and we're back here later the next day IRL I think we left in a position where we were just about to end the turn if, we're, if I'm not mistaken while I was away I thought about the fact that she's ridden all the way up here by herself and that that could be she's quite a long way out of position now and can't really get back to help us if things go pear shaped so we'll see if we live to regret that hopefully not I think I can end the turn here do I need to just do a quick check of everything? A quick security check? Yeah, Stig came down here. She wants to fight this. Try to take the fortress. Let's see about that. Okay, oh, we're, we're good, we're good. Blue. Yep. Fine. Eh. Don't love that. She comes up here. They don't know what to do with themselves. Straker comes back towards the stronghold. Teal gets in a boat. Okay. Alright, so I always like to look at what Teal did, because they were the last one I just watched. They've made a big army. No, they haven't. No, no one. Useless. Terrible. Terrible. Blue's doing stuff. Who is this blue guy, anyway? Eris? Okay, doesn't look very impressive. Ignissa, it's all pretty futile. Yeah, okay. So Lizzie is in control down here. She could pop back up, now that I'm paying attention, and kill Ignissa. Or she could just go and try and capture the fortress now. Day five? Let's scout the fortress. Let's find out how, how hard it would be to take. Okay, keep coming. There's no one home. And there's a horde of magi here, then yeah. It might be worth doing at some point. Well, I just walk up to the walls here. Not much they can do really here. I mean, they can desperately hire some dudes, but I've got tons of spell points and I'm a pretty good spellcaster. Let's do the big move we wanted to do. Uh, we've got the ghost dragons now, we've got the skellies. I'm not buying the wraiths, I don't think. After I've ridden past here, I'm going to give them to Rissa. Maybe I could buy them. Uh, let's go back in. That's not exactly a high stakes play, is it? Three grand? That's three grand. That's. I just think they're a rip off, man. I'm not buying them. Just leave them behind in case we need to defend the town. They can do that job. Let's get Rissa these ghost dragons. him to permanently carry them around. Okay. Aiden talks to Tamika. Zai, there is time actually to head up to... Uh, what is there? Hmm. She wants to learn logistics as well. Maybe just go let her do that. Tamika's done it. Tamika's not stopping, so... Aiden gives her this. And I guess it makes sense to grow the stuff in Wormwood. So I should take these. Oh, there it is, Ring of the Magi. This is what I had last time. So, yeah, it doesn't really do anything. It just makes it that my spells are 
never run out, basically. But they already kind of never did before. Well, actually, then again, for a hero like Tamika, that actually is kind of maybe impactful for a change. Last time I was playing the Conflux campaign when I made the Ring of the Magi, and I had it on a hero with huge spell power, where it was just like, ah, oh, this doesn't feel that powerful. You know, compared to the Wishing Well. Just not that great, right? It's just okay. Alright, um, maybe... Maybe Rissa would like a Ballista. Kind of rhymes, so we'll go with that. Alright. Tamika, take all of this and give it to her. Someone gone there yet? Yes, alright. I love having the crystal warehouse nearby, it's so nice. Now, my dear, take, take, take. I'll take these. I'll take these as well. Um, you don't need a two skull caps. I guess we'll keep them floating. So yeah, she's okay. Defense is a bit bad. Nine ghosties. The problem is the rest of this army isn't very good. Twelve. Twelve of these are, aren't going to get a lot done. Uh, it's day five. So she pops her head up here gets defense so that's good she can't fight blue like that's just gonna be too scary she could be a proper pain in the backside though for them flag these things get the sulfur dominate the area have the trading post maybe wait around for day one and then we'll get you some fresh stuff certainly get you these three bone dragons back anyway as well by that, by that stage I think that's okay she could also gallop down here too much of a waste, I think. Let's just do these ones. Can she learn that? No. Okay. Well, actually, then, let's do this. Get the luck, the moves, come here, get the defense from the Battle Scarred veteran. Come on down here. Cool. All right, so she's got, she knows what she's doing with her life, this girl. She's, she's got it together. Um, all right, Nimbus. He visits a monk, learns a thing or two. You fill up at the well there, why not? That goes with that. What is up through here? Nimbus is just a perpetual explorer, it's all he does. He just wanders around all day. G, you've done that. Congratulations. I'm not scared of Straker taking a stronghold, I don't need you to come back and do anything about it. So that's fine. What am I going to do with her? I never found out what that is. I could just give this to Aiden. What's Aiden going to do? He's got this stuff. Come here. All right, on to Septiana. Now, what's she doing for? I feel like she's run straight up through here in the hope of finding a town, but we've found nothing. I still think I'm going to follow the path anyway. Okay, well we found a, a town. I think that's a location. Isra is here. She's in Port Evendor. It's a cove. All of the creatures in there are going to die as soon as I attack to make way for... Yeah, she's got a hodgepodge of all different creature types in there that all have to make way. Well, she can absorb one of them, the best one. So the one to four bone dragons will still be there. And I'll be up against this army. We know how good Isra is. Uh, expert earth mage. Huge attack defense. Better than Septiana's. Yeah, we 
have to think about this. Let me bring the, the two comparisons closer together so we can contemplate it a bit better. I don't really have time to go back and get reinforcements. And if I kill Isra here, she's dead. There's no escape. She can't get away. Right, if I go here, I still have even a few movement points left to walk into the cove after I've done it. I just can't see Isra winning this. Yeah, she can do slow, expert slow. I can do export, expert teleport in response with the Dread Knights. And then it's just... Well, she's got good Dread Knights too, though. Or I could just sit there, be slow, and implode. Just keep imploding over and over again. There's not a lot Isra can do about that. Right? with the teleport and everything, we probably do just want one pile of uh, Vamp Lords. It might be a bit painful, but I think it's okay. She's ready with a bow, she's ready to rock, there's no morale. Luck is switched off. You're not going to destroy undead, right? Because destroy undead is a spell that hits all undead on the field. Yeah. All right, we're in good shape here. Let's do this fight. I'm procrastinating, I know I am. What haven't I thought of? What haven't I thought of? Just do it. Come on. No, I don't. Okay, it says we lose. Let's not apply that battle result, shall we? Alright, there's only 50 of these sea dogs. Right, so it's hands off until you let me know. I lost 13 vamps there, right off the cuff. These are very fast. 56 goes down to 54, so that's the effect of the... Um, Cool shot, or whatever you want to call it. Um, accurate shot. Alright. So. Let's attack here first if we think that's what we're doing. Four to five. Um, not too worried about the ammo card. Okay, I didn't kill all of them. Yeah, so this kill this this puts some hurt on the Haspers. I think that's worth doing. So I'll take this retaliation. And I guess I will attack you. Ring, ring. All right, let's do this. Implosion. Still get back and uh, help the liches. Well, so it's your turn. I can't do anything. I'm just going to sit back and let you hurt me. Oh, that's really bad. Oh, that's a strange choice. Okay. 
Okay, that's why the auto resolver is um, unhappy with us. Okay, I think I've changed my mind. I think I want to see if he has resurrect. If he has resurrect, that just suits me. I'm the one with the vampire lords, right? So I can just I can just restore these dudes. Twenty five come back, and then another truckload of them come back. Yeah, we're back to full, right? And that frees the liches up. Uh, there are two bone dragons. I'd like to hit these, but I want to use this guy first. Kill three to four. Do this. The other thing I could do, hmm, how far can I move? No. All right, I'll wait until the yeah. I'll waste my waste my waste my hate on you. I will walk to here. And then I'm going to do this. And I'm going to do that. Kills 5 to 9. Yeah, there's no retaliation, just do it. Where's my double damage? See, they're all coming back, son. Alright, I do have to wait until they do their thing. Yeah. Okay. That's not good for you. That's a terrible attack on his part. Who cares about the liches? I can just raise them back up again. When I'm ready. Seems good. Okay, where do they act? They act after these? How far can I move? Five. One, two, three, four, five. He can get there. So yeah, let's just pile into this. Or I could just go for that. How about I soak up these retaliations with the Lich? Wait. I need the water at least to move, right? No, the zombies are going to move. So if the zombies move... To here. here, can I go? One, two, three, four, five. No, I can't get there if, if I stand. Alright, maybe do zombies on ghosties? Maybe I'll do this actually. Ah. Take this. I'm just trying to keep that really deadly stack. Oh, what a retaliation, man. I probably should have taken that with the liches. May have been a mistake. So we just have more mass. We have bo more body mass index. That's pathetic. These are all coming back. <laughs> yeah, because Isra's already cast the Lightning Bolt, I'm just going to do the Ellie's now. So the Haspids and Black Knights both died on that square. The zombies died here. And so that's what we need to be mindful of. These are expendable. Like, I'm not getting them back, so who cares? Just get in there, girls. 
And... It doesn't matter, you're too small to matter. Okay. That's what they're there for. Really? Oh, wow. That's just excellent. Well, that was idiotic. Um, so keep draining, and I will start raising. How many were there? About 110 at the beginning? Uh, yeah, definitely waiting. Is this worth bothering? Yeah. They take quite a lot of killing, these Nyx warriors, I tell you what. They take a lot of killing. Man, oh man, they're so resilient. Alright, will we just do that? <sighs> 22 HP. Pretty good. Now you take a big hit. Ooh. Okay, so I've Okay, all right, I see what you're doing there. I just want to keep animating everything I can. Yeah, and I might just start hitting the defend button. Oh, that was a mistake. That was it is stupid of me. Because now, yeah. Okay, so can I animate them faster than he can hurt them? Okay, that's actually useful, because now I can do this. Five, doesn't matter. Uh, how many are dead? I'm gonna need to. I need to reanimate everybody. Okay, so some logic. Maybe I should start animating zombies instead, because we'll let the liches take all of the arrow tower until that's ready. Like no one's gonna bother with 51 zombies. Maybe I can convince him to try to shoot these. <laughs> okay. But they, that's fine, right? That's okay. Why? See, I'm going to get you, because I've got more. I've got tons of spell points. And you're going to run out with 79 and lightning bolting me and stuff. Kills 10 to 17, too risky. Should I do it? Don't let me down. If I attack these, they better not die. They might retaliate. Yeah, that's really, really bad. They, they, they'll attack, and then I'll retaliate and murder them. So, don't go near them. Just do nothing, everyone. so weird, isn't it? Why? Okay, so it's just attrition, to, uh, like it's just, this is fine, right? We're both burning spell points down to the point where he runs out. Arrow Tower's killing zombies is fine. See what I mean? Like it's taking the attention away from the liches. That's just, that makes no sense. You could be reanimating your Dread Knights. I can play this game all day long. Cool, uh, Corsairs in the Battle of Lightning Bolt. Yeah, fine. 
She's on 49, I'm on 166. So that's costing her 10 and me 12 each turn. So, sorry, this looks pretty boring, I'm sure. Um, just doing the same thing here over and over again until Isra runs out of spell points and ideas and I'm able to finish resurrecting everybody. It's pretty rare that you end up with this kind of equilibrium. Oh, finally! Why does it see the zombies as such a big threat, I wonder? Yay! Oh, he's got a he's got to work to a bunch and he can only afford Ice Bolt this time. Now that's close to starting health. I think it is starting health. We've lost one Dread Knight, we've lost several Vamp Lords, and we've still got 20 odd. Uh, 20 odd um, Liches to raise as well. So it's going to be something like what I want is for those two Arrow Towers to kill five zombies, and then I finish the game with everything resurrected. That's what success looks like to me. I think that was their starting. I'm nearly sure that was their starting. Well, it says health left 10. What, I have about 57 maybe in each stack before I started, so they would have made 114. So a little bit more in that stack still. Seven perish from that, that's really annoying. Okay, well, I'll have to hit them again before the end. Okay, Ezra's out of ideas. That's actually alright, as long as all the damage goes to one place. Um, we can work with that. Right, that's their full stack. Okay. I'm not doing this yet, am I? No, I'll wait one more turn. How good were the water elementals, man? That was ideal. And now they've got no, nothing left. Um, there's 17 skellies I can have there too. here, it kills 19 now so I made a mistake, I should have killed these with that shot that did 10 to 17 I should have done that before what are they down to now? 81 so I need two triggers what else could I do? so they have about 2000 health no I can't do numbers. 800 health. So if I hit them with something that hurts, there's also this, but then they might walk up. That would be terrible. If they walked up and meleeed me. I can just shut them up for a second. It's just I'm worried that I'm going to need to do two resurrects.
talk about a war of attrition. Nearly, I'm nearly finished, I, I promise. Is this everything I had at the beginning? Yeah, because I have no whites or wraiths and I have no dragons. This is, this is all the, these are all the guys I can think of that I brought with me. Um, I've got one more to do on him, and then I think we're done. That is annoying. All right, I think we're ready to close it out. If I wait again, uh, he's still slowed. Yeah, I think it's too fiddly. I'm just gonna, I'm losing 13 skellies. So maybe this is sloppy, but I think I've put Isra through enough torture. I've only got 12 spell points left myself. So we'll call it, call an end to it. 15 skellies is better than departing in shame, the way that the auto-resolver wanted us to. So, apply battle result. Yes. Now, we finally killed Isra. Isra is dead. Uh, even deader than she was before. Let's have a look. I'm expecting some good things here. I think the Sword of Hellfire is good. We know what that is. Pendant of Courage, plus three luck and morale. Whoa. I can't make use of it, and neither could Isra really, but holy cow. Plus three to both? So that's a combo artifact, right? That's odd, because it looks like an artifact. I wonder if this is a combo artifact added in Horn of the Abyss, maybe. It looks like something that was a basic artifact in the old game. Anyway, plus three to both is bonkers. That's amazing. Sword of Hellfire? No, okay. Plus six to attack, all right. Buckler's plus four to defense, all right. Seal of Sunset reduces the other guy's power, all right. The gloves we know about, none of these are that good. Okay, what else have you got? Uh, 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 not much. Not much is the answer. Okay. That sword isn't even good enough for me to use. All this lumber? Wow. All right, the town is mine. I can pop inside. Wow, okay, here we are. So, Horn of the Abyss newbies. We have conquered a cove, and you can see everything there is to see here. And we really caught Orange out. I don't know why she didn't hire some of these troops before the fight started. 15 extra sea dogs, all these extra things, aspids and everything else. So this is a fully developed town. I believe this is the... Yeah, tier 7, Whirlpool, where you go to get the Haspids and Sea Serpents. But you can see for yourselves here, look how cool this all is, right? Um, this is the nest where you get the Stormbirds from. This is the temple of those warriors that are really hard to kill. The Sea Dogs here. See what I mean here about the three levels of troop? Which is this cool, unique sort of idea. Blacksmith's over here, the Tavern's over here. We have a city hall, and these are the level two guys, sea men and crewmates. Basically just a walking melee guy. Pretty good attack and good damage, but uh, bad health, good speed. Um, who are these guys? That's the mage guild there, look at that. Look at the art on that, the way that that's rendered. Really, really nice. This is the sorceress tower. Inside the Mage Guild, there's nothing I want. That's okay. And there's the castle. Really, really cool. Um, really nice. Resource Silo is giving me Sulphur. Port Evendor, nice one. Now, Septiana doesn't have to spend the night behind the walls. I don't see a big reason for her to not do so, though with her last movement point tonight. And I can afford to do that because I have the bow, not the bow. <laughs> the, <laughs> the wizarding well, the wizard's well. No, don't disassemble it, keep it on. Okay, so that was a huge win. Um, I will pop. I will pop in and say hello to the locals tomorrow. I promise. 
we're probably going to buy some defenders for this place. Um. Oh, we'll look. Let's just buy a few. Let's just literally buy that many. Just on the off chance. Uh, there's an orange hero somewhere around. Um. I think that's okay. So orange now is in pretty big trouble. I think blue is the, you know, the last real holdout. Let's have a quick look in our tavern, uh, which we did find. It's here. Let's just check the old rumor mill, shall we? Orange has, well, we don't know if that means zero. Haven't been counting. Uh, our army strength is now better than orange. Okay, they do have this hero. Alright. Uh, blue still has the best kingdom army strength according to the, the stats. So, but as we said before, I think blue's strength is spread around a lot of uh, different heroes and different armies. I think Sepp Chen is the most powerful hero on the map. Mm, no. Oh! Oh, Moendor. Yeah, Moendor used to be somebody else's. Now he's back. In my employ. What's the fastest thing? How fast are you guys? Speed 11. Mm. Well, I'll buy a few more than that, will you? He's going to learn a bunch of stuff off her, that's fine. Diplomat's Ring, I have Lightning Bolt and Ammo Cart. Oh, look, I could take some of this stuff off you, but I'm not going to. Give me the Lumber. Take that off you, give me this piece of garbage. Mm, I want that Triple Luck that comes from that, so that's fine. One on the finger? What does this do on my finger? Re reduces morale by one. Well, that's useless. I might as well wear that. There we go. Uh, I have gloves. You can take some gloves. That's actually useful. Ooh, Necromancer's cowl. I think I'd rather have the tabard. My girl. Surrendering is cheaper. I don't plan to do a lot of surrendering. Okay, that's it. Right, we're done. Let me just check I'm wearing that well. I am. Okay, okay. Sorry. Right, here we go. out of ideas so to fight this the good old-fashioned way yep so when the AI starts to do this they've just got no other towns they've just run out of ideas um, Auto'd it for you guys, but something about just holding a siege that I just really enjoy. So there's the cannon. I don't know if, again, Horn of the Abyss newbies. That's the cannon which replaces the ballista for cove heroes and it can shoot sections of the wall, uh, which is really thematic and cool, I think. Yeah, that's nice, that's cool. And you'll notice that Straker won't actually... 
What happened to him? Why? You're, you're slow? Okay. Straker won't actually run. He'll just fight to the death. And that means you've broken the back of this particular faction. Yeah, so it looks a bit strange when the cannon shoots there. That was him shooting the walking dead. And I did lose a behemoth in the end. Um, okay. Teal is always busy. It always looks like they're very busy. I'm not sure what they're actually doing. In and out of boats. Not really sure what they're doing with themselves. Okay. Okay. Aiken is now looking for a new home. I don't think that hero, Alken, I don't think he's... I think I don't think I'll see him flying over here. He might. Do I care if he does? Because none of these troops, he can't, he can't buy any of those troops. So who really cares if he manages it? If he f does gallop all the way down... Well... I have some friends in high places down here. How hard is Alkin to kill with? My marginal ghost dragon army? Should be alright. It be it won't be comfortable. Right. Except Jenny, you've got to go hurt blue now, you really do. Right, let's just do some Moandor first. Trying to get a sense. I want to see if it's safe. We can assume all these have been done. Do I care? The answer is no. Septiana, back to 315 spell points. Thank you very much. Stick your head in there. Have a look at this beautiful place. Look at this. Look at this woman here on top of the... Oh, that's the Oceanid fountain waterfall. That's just cool. I'm sorry, but that is really cool. Graphics, the pixel density, the frequency of which with the, the way the flames and the whirlpool the ripples looks like look at these look at the rippling the graphics is just tuned to be slot right in and look like it's part of straight out of 1999 really really good we can walk around with these because the zombies are that slow anyway okay <sighs> do I want to take any of these with me how sad am I? Am I to dead end? She hooked back round. Waste a day. I think I have to try, right? Because the alternative is is really bad. You know, like her default is. Yeah, I'm hoping this connects through down to here, and there might be some more portals or underground something or other I can do here. Something here maybe that connects into here. Anyway, Stig's the next most exciting person, and there's no one at home for Green. So Green, yeah, he's almost certainly going to commit suicide in front of there on his turn. Once we make this official. There's no way to avoid that. I can't bring them back. Okay, well. Whatever. I, I, can't, I can't bring them back. They're immune to resurrect. I remember that. And I don't know it. Can't hypnotize. Nothing I can do right here. Never mind. We'll just pay the toll, I suppose. Oh. No, okay. Yeah, yeah. Pop in and have a look. Here we are in the fortress. Let's have a look at the <coughs> Mage Guild. Oh, it's level one. All right. Rather pointless. Do I have the first aid tent? I do. I've got all these things. I'm pretty cool, didn't you know? I don't need to defend this. Just come straight back out again. Just come straight back out. 
Okay, this is the underground to that. No one ever bothered unlocking. Okay, I'm here doing this. And kind of just controlling this region. Waiting for reinforcements, I think, wasn't I? I don't learn ballistics, I love ballistics. And can I beat you? Yes. Uh, sad. All right, stand here. G. Do this. Um, yeah, Nagash, you were going to go for a, a jog. I think troglodytes will be in their native terrain down here, right? Um, just wondering how much they're going to slow my army down. Okay, come back. She might end up being... Let's do this, yep. Uh, so end of day seven, she'll be out of range. Okay, maybe we'll ignore Wormwood and come back to here? I don't know. We're in control here, we just need to make sure we don't slip up and let accidentally blew back into the game or let them catch us by surprise and water I think they've still got the best army by army count kind of thing you know so I have to respect that I feel like yeah we can ignore the capital Randley's still here but we can pretty much just let it go now and we can just focus on Cold Soul and Worm Warren I think that's what I'm going to do which means I need a hero here for day one. There's some dead here you could get first, day six. Yeah. <sighs> yep, that's perfect. Well, actually, uh, come to there. Alright. What you got? Bluey two shoes? Are you landing on my home island there? Okay. Suicide as predicted. I think I might just let this resolve. I'm not going to watch it again. Galar just kills himself. I don't know if he fled, but I don't think it matters, right? Okay, Alkin is serious. He's actually serious about this. Okay, fine. All right, let me just double check how good that green hero is. The other green hero? Not good enough. Yeah, I may need to invest a little bit more there. Who is this? Okay, so Randlu can just defend that, right? Can he? Really? 39 wraiths? Is that enough? See what I mean? 39 wraiths might not be enough. I mean, if they accidentally die, if, if, you know, if Aeris doesn't find the town and attack it, right now on this turn I get a new fresh week of troops but could be sketchy okay I'll try to defend it old Rayleigh doesn't have any skills whatsoever in combat he's never fought before ever now if they take our town do I lose the grail Ooh, this could be quite high stakes. There's no one who can help him. I thought we were in the clear. There's yet yeah, no one near him. So we could be about to lose Dark Eternal. Um, well, then again, Arrow Towers hit the Sea Dogs right up front. Eris needs to be a good spellcaster for to pull this off. 
I think. Yeah, Eris does need to be a good spellcaster, but it's possible we will lose. Uh, lose the Grey Lair. She's too far, way too far away to help. Throng of Pixies is no match for me. Don't you know who I am? Um, yeah, still want to kill you. Just take that, it's not a problem. Do this. I'm on an adventure. Um, lots of Master Genies are actually quite annoying, and I don't really want the Wyverns. Okay, Septiana. No one ever wants anything that I've got that I know that I've got. Ah, it's a dead end. Well, it was worth a gamble. We were hoping it connected through, man. Right, that stinks. Moandor, can you find me a portal or something, man? Ooh, the library would have been good. I wish you'd come this way. Oh, well, am I supposed to go up that way now? Yeah, well, that must be the way that that connects through there, so she could try to head up down, down this way now. Has to be some other way out of here. Yeah, Riss is waiting to receive a great big amazing army. And we want to get ready to take... Yeah, 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 I remember this now, so Tamika comes to here. Go ahead. Give me these. Yeah, you'd look good doing good wearing that. Go on, take it. Take it with my blessing. Uh, I am going to need you to. Mm, okay. Yeah. All right. Hang on. So these are going to need to go there. Yeah, yeah. Well, then again, we're not doing. Maybe I can this time, but get the whites right. Yeah. Right. You wait here, Aiden. Get your skinny butt to here. We want one of you standing there. Who has better moves? G's the one with the better moves. Um, actually, you can stand there. goes gives you the thing there you go as far along here as you can all right that's not too bad it's a bit of a not quite exactly right but it's all right Rissy you've still got time to kill hey eh? I guess for tomorrow <sighs> next week we're upgrading uh, cold soul to a fully upgraded necropolis so we don't have to keep doing it back and forward uh, I'm gonna need to wind up here soon all right uh, I think this is okay done everything we've can we've done everything. yeah all right let's see what they want to do wait a minute no hang on sorry uh, yeah I did want to just reinforce I can afford that now just make absolutely sure of it Okay, that's it. No, no, not enough moves. Messed about flagging windmills and getting windmills and stuff. Idiotic. Looks like we might lose a stronghold now, though. This is fine. Oh, I never reinforced the... I was meant to... <laughs> that's why I'm so pernickety, right? It's why I'm so pernickety before I hit the end turn button. I meant to <laughs> reinforce this. Uh, and they've bought the titans that are there. All right. Well, look, it gives Septiana something to come back and do, doesn't it? Ugh. 
That's stupid of me. My window. Tell me what's down here, man. Hey. What is all this? How do I get out of here? Oh, connects through to here as well. I'm just coming back. I'm just getting out of here. I'm going the long way. I feel stupid. Uh, okay, that was so stupid of me to not defend the tower. Sorry, everyone. Do this, do this. What? Oh, no. What? How do I lose two thingies? Two energy elementals. Anyway. Yeah, 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 yeah. <sighs> man. Man, oh man. How can I challenge the tower quickly? It's here, right? It's up through here. So if Rissa came down now to here, how many moves does she have left after that? 329 on the other side. So if you get to about there, I pop out, get to, back to about here, if I ride to there, I can get to about there maybe? Big back and forth. It's a whole extra day of mucking around to try to get Rissa's army up to challenge Aiken. I think we need to do that though, right? There's nothing better for her to do. Well, I was going to get her ready. Okay, let's just do what we were going to do. Let's just do what we were going to do. Um, buy everything. 33k? Okay. Couldn't get it all. Do what you were gonna do. Hey folks. A uh, random thing happened there, as I was galloping galloping along, there was a crash. The game crashed. Okay, so one thing to be aware of is that that can happen. Thankfully, uh, the game does auto-save. Um, so the last save point I had was where I clicked the end of turn button. Now sadly it means we are going to have to watch Aiken walk in here and take Athenium again. Because <laughs> I have this kind of no do-overs rule. Um, yeah, hopefully it doesn't keep crashing in the same point. I, I hope it was just a, a glitch of the system. Um, sometimes the AI doesn't actually do the same thing every time uh, if you reload an autosave. Um, anyway, so that happened. We know all this. We know that that happened. Who is that orange hero? I missed this. Brissa, where did you come from? I missed this last time we actually... She just came out of nowhere. <laughs> you slippery devil. Okay. Now, the crash happened as Tamika was about to give Aiden the army. It might have had something to do with when I clicked the maximum button. So, let's just do this the old-fashioned way. Oh, 
Okay. To make a rod to here. Okay, Aiden. I think as was it just as he was talking to her, it crapped itself. Okay. Right. Well, I completely understand what happened. It's okay though. I'm willing to forgive that. That's. It's not a deal breaker for me. All right, Nagash. I didn't quite get that right. Um, Gash does swap a room. Yeah, can't do the trogs now because we have one of everything. Do I just die to Brissa? Well, I don't care. If Brissa comes out and kills one of us, that's not really a problem. As long as we've done that. Uh, why don't we do that? Because I'll try to upgrade them. Yeah, alright. G pops in here. Yeah, I'm going to get you all these guys back today anyway. We've got 38k in the bank. What do they cost to upgrade? A fortune, I bet. Hmm. It's not too bad. Hey, Rissa, are you still near the trading post? Yes, you are. Do this. Come here. I'm gonna need money, so I'm gonna sp I'm gonna do everything I can do. All right, I'm happy to just spend money now. Let's do Dark Eternal first. So, what do I need to defend this? Okay, I can't venture out. That's okay. That's right. Do -do -do. Zombies are good value for meat. I may as well pile into them now. Alright, Rissa, I, I need quite a lot of money, babe. I need, I need like, at least five grand, I would say. Crystal in abundance now. Uh, no, wait, go back to Dark Eternal. Just to make sure of it here. Who is that idiot? Let me go back and have a look. Oh, I don't need to go crazy. A few sea dogs. Probably got enough already, even. Grab me these. I might leave it at that. Harris, you're going to have to have a great day at the office. Boom. No, get it right. Hang on. Is that right? There we go. Upgrade. Ah! Can't afford the upgrade now. I've run out of money again. <laughs> Give me even more money. for what they are. I'm not a fan of wraiths. Can't kill her today. Who's better at killing me or Nagash? I'm level six, he's level three. And he's a bit of a noob. Can we get back to here? The reason I'm in a hurry is I want to run up here to at least trap Aiden. Do I have time to do both things? The problem is if I come down here, there's no one left back here to defend against that army. It's an annoying army in terms of size. I am actually going to do this because I don't think you can. Yeah, so she knows where I am. She knows she can't run in this way because she'll die. So she'll run out that way. Nagash is already nearly perfectly placed. 
I think he's perfectly placed, right? If he runs past me and takes the town, how much do I care if she takes the town? I don't actually need to worry about that too much. It would annoy me if she killed Nagash and all these free skellies. It would annoy me if she could catch either of these two bros. That's okay. Now, this we've seen this already. I'm sorry, everyone. Um, Pre-crash. Thankfully, the crash didn't really... You know, it's not like we did this epic, epic fight. And, um, you know, I have to waste everyone's time, although I am wasting your time by making you watch this again. And I click the wait button there, rather than the defend, so that's even more time wasted. I will wait now. Yeah, so 24 satyrs. Don't mess with them. Yeah, we did this. <laughs> Everyone just pretend that this is the first time this is happening. Yeah. It's, no, it's never good. It's never good. And Moandor did all this, which I'll continue to do. Yeah, we, are, we did everything backwards. Uh, when I reloaded. Oh, yeah, I came down here, didn't I? Yep, okay. And we decided Septiana was just getting the H out of here. She's, you can picture her storming back down the road, furious that we left the tower unattended. And the rest of the team are desperately scrambling to try to sort it out before she gets back. <sighs> Fun times. Happy with this? I bought the 12 Magic Ellies. That's going to be tons for that. Stronghold is being threatened by... Oh! <laughs> Oh, very fun times. <sighs> what am I going to do? Let him have it? <sighs> I've left the trading post now. What do I, what do I realistically need? Right, I need... I've already got four behemoths. All right, let's do this. Let's just do it. It's not. It's not ideal. I'm playing sloppy here. Um, let's sell everything right down. Right down to the bone. I'm not building a lot more buildings now, so. I really want to make this hard for the AI to deal with. And to avoid a crash, we'll just do the same thing. I think Ogres are really good VFM. And by them? Rocks? I feel like maybe rocks. Uh, are rocks that great? Orcs health 15. These are health 10 for 100. I'll go for the rocks, I think. And I will get rid of this for morale reasons. Alright, well look. If Tazar really wants it, he's going to pay a pretty heavy price for that. That's not an easy. That's not an easy army to chew through behind the walls there. It just occurred to me that he'd been trotting around down here. Is there a second hero down here too? Yeah. Yeah. So between the two of them, if they want the stronghold, maybe let them have it. Okay. Nearly getting there, ish. We just need a few things to happen right, like Brissa and everything. All right, folks, we're back, and I think we said we were going to hit the end turn button, so rather than try and refresh my memory of everything, let's just do that. Blue hero thinks twice. This was, yeah, this was at risk of happening. So blue, doing a lot of different things. Green, a glorious victory. Ignissa commits, make the ultimate sacrifice in front of the walls. I think I will play it out. For flavour reasons. For flavour reasons, if nothing else. But this is... 
yeah, the AI does do this. Uh, let's wait. And shoot these. These guys come to here, I guess. And is that worth doing? Move the conversation along a little bit. Let's take this shot here. Might as well do this. gonna flee you're not gonna flee are you okay Ignissa okay we got it down to one instead of three that's not too bad and green has been vanquished Ooh, that's the end of you and then there were three or four I can't remember maybe five let's have a look see who else is dead but that's the end of green Alright, orange, yeah, yeah, yeah. But you're not serious. What? You're. F what? Hey! Didn't we want this fight to happen? <laughs> okay, that's terrifying. Well, I'm obviously not going to apply a battle result. This was. I wanted this to happen. So, what is this? She's 3 3 13 12. So it must be that she's just going to do him like meteor showers and implosions and stuff. Um, like chain lightning, maybe. What is she? We never found out what she is like, but it's got to be just direct damage, right? With 124. How else can the? How else can we possibly have that auto resolve result? So I'm gonna guess that it is Meteor Shower. Maybe Implosion, maybe Chain Lightning. Maybe all, maybe well, one of them, one of them is. Because there's just no way she can deal enough damage quickly enough, so it's gotta be AOE. It could be. Yeah, that's not Armageddon. It couldn't be Inferno, um, Fireball or Inferno, because they're not gonna do enough damage. It's gotta be one of them, maybe Meteor Shower. So we'd love to get, is there a way, what can she do? Ooh, train lightning. So one way to deal with that, if I slowed, she has nothing, she's such a bad hero. She's like okay, a just basic slow. That would slow the Titans, the Dread Knights, my vamps. No, hang on. Yeah, so his wraiths go before my liches. Uh, so I'd like to get my 19 vamps out here. Okay, so your speed 11. If I cast haste on these, they become speed 12. Sorry, these vamps, I, I get, they become speed 12. They'd run out of here. I could also race haste these guys to speed... 10, and then they'll start acting first each round as well. They'll become a proper pain in the backside. So my rationale is I don't want to leave any... Well, I don't want to leave high-quality meteor showers. And the Titans go first. So I think on that basis I'm going to haste someone. Just have to figure out who's better, these or these. It's, it's definitely these, right? That's actually my most valuable stack, maybe, and I need to move the Burn Dragons, the Ghost Dragons now. Which means we could do this. Kill zero? What? Seven of my boys can't kill one? This 
seamen, they're pretty dangerous. Although triple negative morale. <laughs> and the same with the Titans, okay. Um Do I just go for every do I just go for this? I might just go for this. Because I can't escape the seamen, Titans, everything anyway, so. Yeah, I'm gonna do that. It's a pretty high value attack. There, okay. Okay, so it didn't work. Oh, the Titan still went. Oh, I thought I had speed. No, no, no. Okay, uh, logic, logic bomb there. Sorry. I guess what was happening, but I didn't, I didn't address it well. <laughs> Uh, which is annoying. Flying over to here at full speed doesn't do anything. Now that she's cast and I've cast. So I might as well just wait. We're going to lose so many. Um, well, I'd rather the sea dogs came and hit me, but they probably won't. Same with the vamps, right? How much will a sea dog? 400 damage. Oh, I'm gonna lose almost all of them. Ugh. Into there. Oh boy. Go for the cannon, and the sea dogs will. Seamen, yeah. Oh, man. Not good. Cannon goes off. Okay, well, the wraiths do have a hit. I need to get stuck in, don't I? I don't have the luxury of waiting around. So we're in amongst them, it makes it harder for. Oh. Makes it harder for chain lightning. For what to do. We have mixed ourselves around. I'm going for the best stacks I can find. Um, you know, so Chain Lightning doesn't look as good. Well, she hit everyone there. Ugh, that's really bad, man. Really good chain lightnings. There's only 12 of them left now, so that's good. Okay, that's an interesting exchange. That's great for us. The morale is huge. Um, I just don't think we can win. There's too much meat here. Um, Titans go next after that. So let's just keep our best units defended. Kill 95 to 1. What's this unit here? 8? Eight? 8 by 18. That's a waste. We'll go for this. Start work on these maybe next. Yeah, that's not too bad. Okay, we did lose one. Yeah, I'll have a crack at these. They seem a bit better. Standard lightning bolt. She's got tons of them left, though. I can't believe we're losing this fight. Like, it's so annoying. Ugh, that's terrible, man. That's woeful. Can't make this attack. It's just suicidal.
out of spell points here. Isn't that amazing though, that she could be so much stronger than I realised. Oh dear. Well. Um, can I kill one? <sniffs> Nearly. That's a bit better. If she accidentally dies, how sad am I? I guess I'm pretty sad. I'm not going to flee yet. Try and kill as many as I can here. Damn. They all came back. Bloody hell. Oh, I'm really mad. I'm <laughs> really, really mad. That's shocking. That's just... She's so much stronger than I realised. Yeah, pointless. Ah. Kill two to three vampires. I guess I'll go for sea dogs here. Alright. Ugh. Woeful. But, okay. She's burned up spell points at least. She's stuck down there. Damn it. Ah. Uh, terrible couple of turns. Woeful decisions. Terrible oversight on my part. The um... so now, am I going to lose this town? Yeah, if she's if she can do wishing well or something, I could be in big trouble. I think without wishing well, we might be all right. What's left in here? No, I've got no reinforcements down here at all. So I need Septiana to come roaring back down. Let's do that. Oh my word. Screaming back down. Take the well off because you're back to full. Okay. <sighs> Where's Alkin? He's here with a pretty formidable army of his own. <laughs> um, yep, okay. So if he comes down under here uh, and makes to threaten me, I can I can get to here tomorrow. Looks like I can get underground. Yeah. Um. She's here, so she can help. Can she beat Alkin? It's not clear. Tough fight. Probably just just about Pippet. She's here, right? So she can come down uh, to here. Yes. Yes, why don't you do that now? Come now, because... <sighs> Tell you what... Um, right, you boys are going to need to try to defend this town against Brissa. <laughs> uh, 
There's a skull cap. <laughs> What can you do, mate? Gather them all together for me. Hop in the transformer. Right, she will annihilate this army with... So the arrow towers won't... Yeah, there's just no way that's enough. We need to think about this. Okay, so looking at it as well, the way we've laid this out, this is just perfect for chain lightning, which we don't really want to do. But she did 600 and something damage. So she's just going to be able to walk in and take this, you know, without any... Like, there's no point. There's no point trying to defend it. Is what I'm saying. By doing this, we force her to use. Not even, she has liches, right? So. Does she have liches? No, Titans. Yeah, so the Titans kill one. She has to chain lightning the other two if she wants a one turn fight. But there's no point wasting Nagash's life here. We're gonna have to just keep a scout on her and then come back another time? Uh, with Septjenna or someone else? So we have to abandon Worm Warren. This is not good, people. We are going in the wrong direction. If Aiken comes down under here to challenge, if he can make it all the way to me, good on you. I think what's going to happen is Septchena is going to... Yeah, so we want to leave Tamika here in case Septchena can come down and war... Alkin? If she can't, we could just give the army to Tamika, who is a level one. <laughs> Damn. I don't think Alkin's all that crash hot, though. And in fact, Tamika can have a very, very good army for that fight against old Alkin. Ideally, it's Septiana that gets to do the fight, though, right? If he gallops down here, brings war to here. I'm probably just going to chase him, put Septiana here, and then that way I'm kind of blocking Brissa from doing anything as well. He comes down. I think she might be okay just exactly where she is. I'm just going to leave her exactly there. Moendor. Get the gems. Get this, I guess. Never found a way out of here. Tower of the Seas, I think, is where you get sorceresses. That looks like it's free, so I might pop in there. What's Lizzie up to? Horde of Horn Demons. Is this a quest she wants to do? Yeah, she has spell points. Let's let's have a let's have a fun fight that we actually think we can win. What? Oh my god! No, what? Oh, how many are there? A hundred? Oh, people! 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 What is happening to me? So, look at the damage. I do 666 to the demons. Seems appropriate. I think I'm going to be using all of that. Is there any reason to do anything other than this? I'm expert air, so it's air only. Haste is something. Your speed's 6, I'm speed 7. I don't think I'm going to be hasting. I think it's just this while we can, right? Oh, I thought arced, sort of arced three times there. Dun, dun, dun. One, two, three. Yeah. Okay, well, thank God for Stig. Hey, fellas. 
should have waited with the air rallies. That was a mistake. I'm playing so badly tonight. I'm so sorry. Sloppy. Jalopy. Uh, I'll just stand here. Stand there. Same again, because the first bolt goes there. Yeah, yeah. Chain lightning. It's good to be uh, able to use it on the enemy instead of having it used on me. Wow, what a difference a couple of chain lightnings make, eh? Hence what we saw before with Brissa. Nasty business. Losing my whole, all that investment, all those creatures. I mean, I gave her a pretty big headache. You know, I definitely put the herd on. At least to a degree, but a hundred wraiths, like, it's a pretty bad outcome. something. We lost some spell points, but anyway. Oh, look. Luck. Nah. Sure, why not? Do I want wyverns? So if I move, if I have the first move, What are they, serpent flies? No, I won't get the first move, will I? Dragonflies and stuff? Ah. I don't think I'll bother. I very often just don't bother with... Um... This would have been good, actually. A Horde of Familiars in the Naga Bank. Yeah, that could be meaningful. Let's do this. Take the free hit here. Two Ellie's, no way. Not unless they get a morale flash. Uh, so 18 of them are going to deal at most 30 something damage. Yeah, we've got defense 14 versus. He's not. He's not. He's not going to do anything to me. Plus, I get to shoot first anyway. Yeah. Uh, this is fine, right? Even if they Naga Queens, I'll have time to do Expert Haste. I think lots of Nagas. Yeah, with my spell casting, I can do it. <laughs> it's like, come on, man. Alright, they're all speed 5, so all my people go first. And it's probably just Lightning Bolts. I guess once we're all over here, I can... Chain lightning, so that'll arc to there. So I need to move the water elementals before doing it. So one way to do this would be to wait with these. Move, 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 and then when it comes back to them, these three will have together. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, that might be better for now. Let's just lightning bolt her. Sort of coming over. If I retaliate. Oh, I don't retaliate. That's right. Nagas don't have uh, retaliation. Uh, 
uh, I'm pushing the Alt key here. So what you can do in Horn of the Abyss, like let's say I wanted to walk up in melee. See how I've turned it into a sword there? By pushing the Alt key, it changes from an arrow to a sword. Uh, which is just functionality that we all wish had been there at the beginning uh, when the game was first invented. Um, so I'm thinking, if I move this guy to here, I can then chain lightning cast, start here. No, I need to start mm, here. So there's a risk this, that the first jump goes to the satyrs instead of to the to these guys. So I can't do that. I have to start the lightning bolt here. So it's going doof doof doof, and then I'll cop the fourth one. I still think that that's better. So let's attack in melee up here. See, that's so nice. You can't do that in the vanilla game. Oh, actually, I have a chance. I have an opportunity to move, so I could, if I move to there and the satyrs move out of the way, by my calculations, if I chain lightning here, it'll hop to here, then here, then here. So let's see. Yeah, on the water elementals turn, if I can do this, get out of the way. <laughs> She's like, get out of the way. Please work. Yes. Nice. That's the first sensible thing I've done since logging back onto me. Now these guys can uh, get to the satyrs. At the moment uh, I can be hit by everything, so I think I just want to run again. Yeah. Let's stick do the heavy lifting. This will hurt, but... Not too bad. Three's not too bad. And... One, two, three, four, five... They're back in the game. So I can bolt that. I can't get away though, right? One, two, three, four, five. The satyrs can act first. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I can't run. No. Uh, what else can I do? Can I blind? Line slow. Line isn't much better than just lightning bolt. I can hypnotize somebody. No, that's not bad. Yeah, let's do that for once. <laughs> let's do that. Okay, I'll wait till the water elemental's turn to see how much damage we're gonna do. Uh, I guess we'll soften up this. Mm, yeah, I guess I'll wait with these guys actually. Who do I care about more? I care more about these living, I think. I'll make this attack. Hmm. Okay, so that's 84 and that's 85. But that's the one that goes first. So I think it's actually that one that I want to hypnotize now. Now, to rub salt in the wound here, on her turn, she can walk down here and with no retaliation smack this one. She can then go one, two, three, four, five. So she can get to the water at least, but she probably won't. Will I just do this, or should I do this? I'll go for this. There's 13 left on that stack. I don't kill any if I come down here, but I can kill one if I come here. 
that's worth doing. And you never know, the two of them might turn around and attack the hypnotized. No, okay. Oh! What? Why did you only move to there? That seems odd. Um, should I do this? I don't know. I'm taking rather a lot more damage than I have wanted to. Sorry, just checking. Thirty six health left. I should actually be able to make this attack. Okay. Oh, what happens now? Do you snap out of it? Because I'm not going to be very happy if that happens. I'll tell you what, just in case, let's make you walk all the way over here. <laughs> oh, you can't even defend yourself. That's excellent. What happens when I attack? So she won't retaliate, right? Because she's hypnotized. Oh, man, why did I have to experiment? Oh, I run the hate away. So they do retaliate even against friends. I suppose that's fair, because when you berserk them, um, if you cast berserk... I was going to... Yeah, she's completely hypnotised for as long as I want, so I can just park her there and shoot at her until... Sorry. I had this thing where she was waking up next turn in my head. I'm going back to being uh, less intelligent. Uh, okay, that's really painful. I hope the rewards are good. Yeah, mysticism's good for me now. Yeah, okay, well, 12 grand's quite nice. And third, wow, that's a lot of gems too, so we'll get very good prices for them at the trading post as well, if we can get back to there. Okay, so we have a plan. The stronghold is safe. They, they, they decided against it. We've got another whole day if Tazar changes his mind and wants to have a go. The main necropolis with Ranlu is safe. Eris realised that that's just way too hard. Yep. So we're saving our money. Conflux is safe from harm. Just have to undo this silly mistake I made. What else could I do? Is there anyone here to hire? Do you have an army? So I could throw money away on Zarfax, just having enough stuff here to have seven stacks of random guys who... She'll have to cast Chain Lightning, one, two, three, four. She'll have to cast it twice. Is it worth spending two and a half grand for the Arrow Towers to get an extra turn shooting? Not really, right? It's just fiddly. Yeah. I really handed them the ascendancy here. Blue gives up, an Arian goes away. Not an Arian. Elgar, whatever he was. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. No. Ah. Okay, so Teal is all but given up. Teal's out of ideas. We can kill Alkin now. There's absolutely no way I'm not to. Oh, he's run all the way in there, the little sod. Look at him. There's no other way I can fight him. So that's a huge problem. Right, because it's just going to rob us of all our movement through the snow with skeletons, taking skeletons through the snow. He knows full well how much of a nuisance that is. There's a 
annoying defenders there for me to re try and retake the town when I'm ready. Oh man, what a disaster. What happened with Theo, with Brissa? Where'd she go? Hello? Can I... Where did Brissa go? This is the guy who was hassling um, Randlu. This is the other one. This is that one. This is this guy, who I haven't seen how strong he is yet. He's flying through here. I have to get the army down to, to, to that. She's gone up there. Okay, sorry, I missed that. missed that, everyone. Worth having another look. So she's run up into the... She's run up into here to maybe recover spell points or do something. <sighs> Yikes. Okay, now the next biggest threat to us is this guy. Eovasius is here. I don't want to fight that army without uh, Septiana. Th these are my terms. I don't care to live by any other. I am going to abandon Wormwood, I think. I just can't defend it all. I've got too much going on. Septiana pops comes pops out of here. She doesn't have time to kill Thingo. We let him live. We let Orange have this. Okay. Comes out of here. Um, I don't think we can defend Cold Soul either. So we have to let Blue take Cold Soul. I will annihilate him though if he stu is stuck behind the walls there. And Ranlu has a decent chance of defending the Necro. Not really. No, he doesn't. Uh, we've overstretched people. I think that's what's happened. Let's let's be real here for a moment, shall we? I could go and fight Eovasius right now with Rissa. Give her everything I've got. The best of the best artifacts. She would have 114, 126 Vampire Lords. 175 of uh, the Zombies, 76 Liches, 42 Dread Knights. Any clue of how strong Eovasius is? I can't remember. Well, he's worse than this. Tiny bit left after. Should get to about here. And should only get to about there tomorrow. I'm not even sure. So here's the thing I don't actually think I can war him today with her. Because I can't get the army to over there fast enough, even if I wanted to. is not how it's supposed to go. What a mistake that was before. Right, I think we know that we're definitely doing this move. Just going to have to leave them to it and come back another time. Alright. Tamika. She'll only be able to bring everything back to about here. So I probably needed to, well... Okay, sprites, do your best. Yep, and we're just going to depend on uh, Septiana now. If I just give you everything, babe, you're going to have everything. Give me the crappy skeletons. But apart from that, you take everything. Just keep everything together. Just 
just not going to take any chances here, right? Just in case he has amazing logistics and he can do amazing things with them. Did you ever get logistics? You did, alright. Disguise. Okay, well, that's we have disguise. Right, take the greatest of the greatest stuff I've got. Take it, take it, take it. 75 boring skellies. And them as well. <sighs> um, actually, I could keep the 75 slow skellies because I don't have... Um, Wraiths. Right, might as well do that. <sighs> Man. something just trying to get free stuff at this point it would have been great to send Septiana up there I wish he'd had time as well just scout these areas what's this thing frigate you can buy pirates here Okay, well, Brissa is not here. Why don't I come down and scout this area? Grab it. Alright, just see if she's interested in coming back around. Nagash. I mean, not much good to me, mate, really. Stiggies. We've run out of skills, but she would have tried to teach me ballistics. Horde of Infernal Trogs. Yes, don't say that I lose one. Oh. Sorry, didn't have to do this. Money now is fine. Lots of Arch Magi. That sounds a bit nasty. Lots of Arch Magi. Oh, guys. I really want to just get on with the rest of the game. Lots of Arch Magi. Mm. Is it worth it for the flavour? Yeah, what am I? A chicken? Please be spread out. Okay, good. Oh! <laughs> that looks like it was painful. Oh, maybe I should have gone for it now. The lightning bolt there. All right. <coughs> oh, excuse me. You stand on a field where a large battle was fought not so long ago. Yeah, five minutes ago. 
you are troubled by the complete absence of corpses. Amongst the broken swords and armors, you discover a ring. That's kind of uh, thematic, right? Because the way the mages die, they kind of vanish like uh, Obi Wan Kenobi. Complete absence of corpses. Where are they all? The Ring of Oblivion, when worn, makes all losses in the battle irrevocable. Corpses disappear right after the unit's death. Spells that may revitalize creatures are banned for use. Vampirism does not bring back dead units, and undead cannot be raised using necromancy after battle. Wow! That is a Horn of the Abyss artifact I have not seen before. All losses are irrevocable. No resurrection. Wow. Actually, it would have been handy for Xi to have that against Brissa. What an interesting artifact. Cool. Okay, I like it. Right, we're still completely on our haunches, waiting to find out whether we're still winning or losing. Um, <clears throat> Septiana has our forces. And, uh, yeah, we have an economic advantage, but a pretty big military deficit. If Astra comes around here, we're cool. There's another one galloping around down here too, isn't he? Yeah, that's Tazar. Okay. All right. Let's keep going. He's their good hero, the one that's got the better army. Okay. Okay. What? <laughs> okay, that's fine. <laughs> Thank you for that. Um, I guess maybe... Why, why did you do that, though? That's just perfect for me. Okay. That's perfect for me. Eovasius ran up here. I can't force him to fight because he has f fly. Like, I'd need to... You can't fly through these walls, though, right? So... Well, the main thing I really want to do is kill Brissa, actually. So that I can seal this area off. Okay, so will we just do the fight, and then we'll make a decision? Yeah, let's do the fight. Okay, it's a solid fight. Good looking fight. He's a garbage hero? Yeah, let's just wait. Oh. oh. Yeah. Okay. Um... You, you all had a bad morale uh, event, let me see. Oh wow, I just kill anything I touch? <laughs> oh man. No, I only killed two titans. <laughs> Do I go for the vampires though? Don't I hit all of these? What happens here? Do I hit everyone? Dear, oh dear. That's annoying, right? Having lost a stack means I might not be getting my um, my stuff back. Right, so with this in mind, I could animate dead that stack. How slow is slow? Not that slow. They're dead. Implosion kills the... Yeah. Implosion kills the titans. But these act first with speed 12. Oh, okay, right, right, right.
Okay, I think I've decided I'm just going to go for Implosion on the Titans. The more I stare at it, I'm just trying to... I don't know. If they just flee on the Haspid's turn, I'll feel pretty sad, but... I'm still doing this right. Yeah, he's out of here. Ah. Okay, so I did lose 24. She's expert estates, and they all come back, but as... <laughs> Uh, as morals. Um, can we make contact with Brissa today? Could Aiden go and visit her right now with my whole army? Is that something I would want to do? Septiana can come back this way without the army. And then we do a huge production line to try to set ourselves up. I don't really want to kill her with Aiden. I don't have a credible, viable secondary hero that's in the area. She's all the way over here, killing throngs of pikemen. Na, na, na. They're hardy fellows, these guys. actually think they'd do that much damage. great time down here but and she's so far from home like she's so far from helping I'm just gonna go with it it's my little B story I'm just gonna keep playing all right someone needs to go kill the tower as well ideally before day one Uh, I'm going to send Septiana down here to kill Brissa personally and then set up a supply chain to get the entire army back to here again and I'm going to use Rissa on the other end as a you know, person of interest alright man oh man who has more moves? how many moves will you have left? 975 Two eight four. Yeah, so Tamika's the one who's doing the actual job. <sighs> Tamika, you better not let me down. I'm giving you everything I've got. Okay. <laughs> um, except this. I'll keep that. I'll keep these boneheads. <laughs> um. Of them. Don't let me down. <sighs> yes, I take casualties, but I'm just going to have to suck it up. These are the wages of incompetence. And we almost certainly want two stacks of these. So, do it this way. Alright, so tomorrow, let's have a look at how far she can typically move. She's got all that movement. So that's about the same as to there, to there. And then she's got like a screen's worth. So she can gallop easily back to the underground tomorrow where someone is going to be waiting for her. Who is that someone? Either Aiden or Rissa. I 
think I like the idea of bring Aiden, bringing Aiden to here. He's going to receive the army off to make it tomorrow. I will be waiting in position here. Brissa cannot hit me from there. Old Nagash is going to come and grab those dorks. You may as well take these, my queen. Well, actually, see, chain <laughs> Mm. So, is there a world where she does chain lightning? Kills four. The AI won't be smart enough to, to put the two titans in two piles. Uh, even then, I think I'd still have one left. I think it's fine. Like, um, there's this ho horrific world where possibi possibility where Briss is able to kill Septiana. Um, and that would be well, the end of the enemy. Now you're going to go here because that will allow us to change our minds and fling the army in this direction if we absolutely have to. Okay, Oyandor is just checking things out for himself, trying to figure out how this part of the world works. Sells it now, let me look for the thingy there. Okay. I could rehire G, I haven't yet, but I could rehire her. In order to do what exactly? If she galloped down here with Septiana tomorrow, does that do nothing, right? It doesn't do anything. I don't need her, I don't need G back in particular. So I'll wait, I'll wait another day before I worry about getting her back, where I'm going to get her. It's nice having the option value when you've got a, a hero to hire back. If you don't need her right away, you, and you've got a big empire, she's kind of got a free town portal, a free teleport right at the very beginning. So don't uh, rush to make your decision if you don't really desperately need the hero back for anything in particular. Or do what you want. I mean, what do I know? Okay, so there's Aiden. Okay, Rissa. Don't take my advice. You saw it. You've seen the sloppiness. You've seen it with your own eyes. Right, no whammies. No silly whammies. Yeah, this guy's fine. Who cares about you? Who are you? Eovasius has a town portal. So we should bear that in mind. He has a free uh, escape from Alcatraz. Teal, you must be joking. No, you're not completely joking. Uh, but I am ready for you. Just buy the rest. Is that enough? Yeah, it should be, right? up to 100 grand here people oh no my serpent fly finally time to say goodbye not an easy fight for Alagar unless he's got some spectacular spells up his sleeve I think I'm pretty confident that we should hold there. Stiggy, let's do you first. Cool. Oh, look at her, kicking goals. Oh, man. <laughs> There's just rather a lot of them. They look like very easy week one fights, but... Uh, and there's this many of them. It's um, a little bit terrifying, I don't mind telling you. Uh, well, what if I do this first? How about now? 
So I can hypnotize this lot. Or I can just bolt them again. Which is, of course, the problem with hypnotizers. There's almost something, almost always something better you could do instead. Um, happy enough with this, even if morale happens, right? Oh, wow, that's pathetic. That's terrible. Terrible decision making on their part. I just think we'll stick around here, get these shots off. Oh, I should have waited. It's not going to matter. Okay. Lightning bolt to the rescue. Let's get through this nice and quick. I know this isn't the main event. Right, Septiana. Yeah, so she's gone and buried herself right up in the corner here, which is really annoying. All right, so we'll do what we came here to do. The losses here are going to grieve me. You know, I'm going to be so annoyed as we're taking them. Yeah, that's just going to hurt so much more than I want it to. Now I'm having second thoughts, actually. So the Vampire Lords have nothing to worry about. Is there a case for making... Oh, no, there isn't, because I've run out of room. Um, what I'm worried about is losing two Ghost Dragons to arrow, a combination of Arrow Towers and whatever. Do I have the bow? I have the bow... May as well put that on. You have no positive morale. You didn't anyway. Uh. Oh, you got terrible morale as things stand anyway. Okay, I'm just I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. It's not where we want to be. Okay, I think we can hopefully do a bit better than that. It's just, yeah, there's no hero. Okay. So, as usual, they pick on the little guy. Now, Master Genies go second. Unless they're blind, of course. <laughs> uh, where do my liches go? After the Naga Queens. Two thirty-five, a uh, two hundred and thirty-five lightning bolt. Let's let's try to lightning bolt something. Okay, that's actually bad for us. Nagas don't do anything. All right, that's not going to be good for you if I do this. You're not going to like that. So. 235, you said? Kills about 11 of them. Really want to be able to do it all next turn, right? You're going to have 400. That's the biggest stack there, but again, they're just getting, like, annihilated. So that's 500 HP there. Vampires are hitting things with delight. Yeah, so then on my turn, I can do a second bolt to finish off the vampires? I don't even know. It doesn't, just doesn't feel that bad to do this. I think these guys are staying back and hitting the defend button. Wyverns are idiots. Now you just die now? Just don't overthink it, maybe. This is fine, right? Yeah. Oh! No, it's not. I did actually lose two as a result. Okay, fine. Yeah, well, I can't do anything about that. Yeah, I forgot that that would be the way that would go down. Alright. Uh, 
So quite a lot of skellies and two vampire lords. Does that kill all of them? Yeah. It's, it's not great, right? Do it. Take that. What? Okay. She brings 28 back. Doesn't feel too bad. Should she pop her head in here? I can't carry any of these away with me. I really don't have time to invest in your upbringing. 200 movement points remain, which will get me to here. Aiden collects the army, gives it to Septi. Septiana gallops down to here to trap Brissa. Yeah, Vassius is still mucking about. There's a good chance he just portals back to his home and we don't hear from him again. So I have time. Aiden, how many points would you have left after doing this? What's he got up his sleeve? Nothing. He's got no time up his sleeve at all. So Septiana has to double back. No, she doesn't because Nagash can do it for us. So on that basis, we have Nagash up our sleeve. So go ahead and take a look in here, learn something. Um, now, I do have a slot. So I could buy gremlins to turn into skeletons. That sounds particularly cruel. Yes, come with me, my fellows. Let me show you a whole new world. Right, Aiden, you're going to have to come back. Swap a roo. Swap a do. Okay with this? And we will begin to try to load. the other hero up. This one? She already has a crown and a great... She's got a good crown, good weapon. She's got nothing in her left hand. This is a better weapon than the one she has. And that's nice. Yeah, she's going to want to wear that. Okay. Aiden, this is the most tooled up version of Aiden you're ever going to see. He's going to do his best, get it to here. And Nagash is going to pick up the pieces. And... Seems alright. Nag, have a chat to your old mate. There we go. You take the stuff. I understand you'll be wanting this back. I don't think I'll bother drinking from it today, just in case Brissa wants to fight me. Okay, so Septian is back on the scene with everything ready to rock. One on the finger to decrease morale. Yeah, having the minus 10% power level would have been better. Is it too late to change my mind? Who has it? Let's go. No, we've left it with Tamika. All the way down here. Okay. Never mind. Never mind. It's probably not as good as it could have been, but whatever. Um, coming to get you. Mm. You may as well give me these hapless idiots, and I will head west with them. Okay, so that's that. Here's this girl. She's ready. Come back if Eovasius comes down here. I just I'm not gonna defend Cold Soul, he can just have it. Yeah, 
think I know what I want to do with Z now. Z, I want to bring her back at Dark Eternal. Have her sitting here. never been there. Power, I guess. Good old combo. Power straight into well. Moandor to do stuff and get stuck. Hang on, mate. It's so baffling, this area. Okay. Yeah, I'm still really confused as to how we're actually going to bring blue down. We can take the fortress down, but how do I find your... How do I get to here? This is the problem. I can't figure out how to get in here. Other than just galloping down through here, which is all the way up down. This way? Like, this is way out of the way? There has to be another route in. 